So, today MRL is coming home, yay! Good morning, internet friends. How are we doing today? How are we, Riddler? You're doing blue. Are you excited for baby brother to come home today? Yeah? Good morning, Sassy. Did you sleep well, sweetie? Yeah? So, today, MRL is coming home. Yay! Um, but I'm up now because I'm dropping off my brother at his work which is by 9 and I don't and I'm not picking up MRL till after 10 because that's what the vet said to do so I'm going to be playing Pokemon Go in Civitan Park for the next hour <laughs> I mean hey it's exercise and then of course I'm all weird looking I've got this shirt I've got neon shorts and then these wonderful socks I oops if I could get to them, there they are. I know, I look super duper fancy. But, yeah. That is the warning, and soon we will be bringing little Fluffbutt home. Are you excited? Little Fluffbutt's coming home. See, I was just happy to have the bed to myself. Mwah. So, we'll check back in with you guys later. Hey guys, so... I just finished walking around Civitan Park. I've been here for a little over an hour and I got four laps in, which apparently is equivalent to about one and a half miles. So, woohoo! Got exercise in and of course I was playing Pokemon Go, so I got a lot of items that I needed. Um, got a lot of Stardust, got a Pokemon put in a gym, it was fantastic. And some of you may be wondering, what in the freaking heck are you talking about, Raven? Um, Google Pokemon. That's the best I can tell you. Because it's very hard to explain. But Pokemon Go is an app based off the Pokemon game. And it makes walking more fun, <laughs> I think. But now, I'm about to go and get me something to drink, and then I'm going to go pick up Emeril from the vet. I'm so excited to see him. So, I just wanted to check in with you guys, and let you know that I exercised, and played Pokemon, but I exercised! And I'll check back in with you later. Hey guys! So there's Riddler, there's Sassy, and look, it's Emeril! He's back home! Hi, baby! How do you feel? Say, I've been playing a lot and I don't even act like I've ever had surgery. So, neutering was a success. Yay! And <laughs> I ended up accidentally confusing people on my social media because they're like, oh my gosh, is he okay? What happened to him? And I'm just like, he got neutered. He's fine. I promise. But, see, he's doing good. Getting his toys and, of course, messing around with Big Brother. I won't be doing very rigorous training with him until the stitches are completely healed. Which, luckily, these are the kind of stitches that will dissolve over time. So, he doesn't have to get them removed. Yay! Riddler was so excited, weren't you, buddy? Sassy, of course, was like, uh, whatever. So... Um, what has the day been? I did yoga. That was awesome. And before I picked up MRL, I walked around Civitan Park. And I think I already talked about that, so forget that. <laughs> oh, hi, Radler. Where'd you go? There you are. Hi. Hey, sweet boy. Who's your good boy? Why don't you just love me? Well, I got home. And took me a nap. And then I had to take my brother to tennis. Came back. I did yoga. Um, worked on the vlog. The vlog is uploading right now. And I'm watching some more AKC Yukonuba National Championship. 
and I also just applied to a job at Petco. Again. <laughs> uh, not Petco, but PetSmart as a grooming bather. Basically, I'd give dogs baths. And I'm good with that. Um, and then once my vlog finishes uploading, like once it's in processing, it's fine. But if I close my computer while it's uploading, it won't upload. So I have to wait for it to upload. And once that happens, Tyler and I will be going out to eat at Las Palmas. Hooray! Fun Mexican restaurant. Um, but yeah, that's what the evening has for today. Hey guys! There's Sassy Girl, there's Mr. Emerald, and then there's Riddler. Now, I gotta tell you guys, Riddler has been a lifesaver tonight. So, as much of the story as I could fit together, Dad had taken Riddler outside to go potty. And Riddler heard something and went tearing across the yard, like literally from one side of the property to the other. And there was some prowler on our property who claims he was with other people. Riddler was like deep-throated bark, like he would have tore this guy into pieces if Dad had let him. But he listened to Dad. Um, I was about to take Amarell out when I heard Riddler barking and I saw Dad with the flashlight and saw it on a face I didn't know. So I went and got Mom. Um... Long story short, the guy ran off, nobody got hurt, which is great, and the cops are currently downstairs talking to my parents, so. Riddler guess, is doggo of the year, aren't you, buddy? You are. You protected your house. And it's crazy, guys, because Riddler is afraid of everything. <laughs> Hi, Bubby. And yet... The only other time he has ever, like, expressed really aggressive behavior was going after, was wanting to go after a pit bull at the vet's office, apparently. But this time he was all about it. And he probably would have hurt the Prowler if Dad let him. So, I'm glad that Riddler barked and warned so that everybody could get in action. I hope the perpetrators are caught. We don't know what they were doing on our property. More likely stealing because there have been issues of robberies in our neighborhood. Like a few months ago my dad had a garden tiller stolen from the property. So but I'm just glad that everybody was safe and Riddler was an awesome dog. And okay, I think some of you anxiety sufferers will understand this. I know some of my personal friends do. You know, you your anxiety is constantly worrying about everything that is not a danger. Yet, when there is pr actual danger present, you're calm. It doesn't bother you. Like, of course, my number one priority was staying with my family and staying with the dogs, making sure everybody was okay. But it wasn't concerning to me. My anxiety wasn't concerned about the fact that there was a stranger outside that could have possibly hurt my dad and Riddler. Which, of course, now that everything's getting calmed down, I'm thinking about that like, oh my gosh, this guy could have actually hurt dad and Riddler. So, which I'm really glad he didn't. I got a brief glimpse of the guy, but I don't know if he was armed or not, but guys, please give a thumbs up for Riddler, because he's the reason that we even knew about the guy. Anybody. Say, so the only downside is I have not finished pooping, and I would like to finish pooping. Yeah? 